People are applying for credit cards for the first time. But some may find themselves caught in a new twist on an old identity theft scam. Howard Ayn has the story of a young victim and how she and her father fought back. If you think 18 years old is too young to have your identity stolen, think again. All a thief needs is a few key numbers and your identity can be compromised at any age. She was uh, getting ready to go away to college and she applied for some loans, small loans. Uh, for books and stuff like that, and she was denied the loans. Michael Carroll thought his daughter was denied because she didn't have any established credit. He and his wife helped her get the loan, but she ran into another roadblock while applying to get cable. We can't issue any cable because uh, there's a problem with your credit. My daughter said, how can it be a problem with my credit? I'm 18, I have no credit. Frustrated and a little scared, Michael's daughter called him and they began to figure out what happened. She contacted the three major credit bureaus and find out Indeed, somebody did get credit in her name when she was eight years old. Turns out, ten years prior, someone had gained access to her Social Security number and applied for credit. And what had happened is, when they applied for credit in her name, they ran the credit cards all the way to the limit, and they never paid them. So basically, she ended up with bad credit at eight years old. In all, more than $15,000 worth of credit had been applied against her name. We will work with the credit bureaus and get it all cleaned up and... Uh, now, it took a while. It took about a year to get all her credit cleaned, and now she has good credit, and uh, she's going forward. The Carroll family has another daughter who's 16 years old, and they put a credit freeze on her credit until she's 18. Postal inspectors say the best way to prevent your child's Social Security number from being used is to be proactive. I always tell parents to check their children's credit once a year. Most of these websites offer uh, free uh, credit checks one, one time a year. In five minutes, you can make sure that no one's stolen your children's identity. Another tip. Anyone can check their Social Security number on ssa.gov. The Social Security Administration's website can see if a workplace or a bank has searched a number. Howard Ain, Local 12 Troubleshooter.